Welcome to Boston.com's Sports Q, our daily conversation, initiated by you and moderated by Chad Finn, about a compelling topic in Boston sports. Here's how it works. You submit questions to Chad through Twitter, Facebook, email, his Friday chat, and any other outlet you prefer. He'll pick one each day, except for Saturday, to answer. Then we'll take the discussion to the comments. Chad will stop by several times per day to navigate. But you drive the conversation. Agree that the Apple Watch thing should be the last straw for John Farrell? For the proof that he has no idea what's going on in his own dugout will be. Nah, his status is going to be determined by how this team fares down the stretch and in the playoffs. I don't know that he should feel great about that. Terry Frankness Indians have won 13 in a row and may never lose again, and the Astros just added Justin Verlander, but that's how it's going to be. Just my hunch. But I think Farrell needs to win at least one round to come back next year. It won't be easy, but for all of the frustrations this season, they've been a resilient group, which was never more evident than during last night's 19-inning win. That reflects on him just as much as the negative stuff does, to some degree. As much as a good-sized segment of the fan base wants this to be the last straw in his tenure, I don't see how it possibly can be. Dave Dembrowski laughed the whole thing off as games Manship, and even Farrell acknowledged it right to steal signs, just via the old school ways. Maybe it says something that the players and the assistant trainer did it without his knowledge, thus showing a perceived lack of respect. But I just think it means that Dustin Pedroia, Brock Holt, and Chris Young are strikingly inept criminals. If they'd been in Ocean's Eleven, the movie would have been over in three minutes. This isn't a great look for Farrell and the Red Sox, but it's not going to have an effect on his status as manager, nor should it. But what do you guys think? Should John Farrell pay the price for the Red Sox sign-stealing scheme? I'll see you in the comments. So subscribe our channel for more videos.